Hello, Rhonda here, taking you through a flow of five yoga warrior poses. There are so many benefits to these poses. It strengthens and stretches your limbs, your arms, your legs, it opens up your hips. You get a sense of feeling more grounded. You improve your balance and stability, which makes you feel more focused. Let's get started. Before we move through our flow of warrior poses, let's warm up. Inhale to sweep both arms up, palms together, hands to heart center. Again. Breathing in and out through the nose with each round of breath, deepening the breath. One last time. Let's inhale to sweep both arms up. Exhale down into chair. Inhale to reach, lengthen. Exhale to chair. Three more times like this. Let's inhale to reach, lengthen. Exhale, swan dive forward fold. Let's hold this forward fold. Let's nod our heads yes and nod our heads no. And then back to yes because we always want to finish in the positive. Bend both knees deeply. Inhale to sweep both arms up. Exhale, swan dive forward fold. Two more times like this. And now let's alternate. Inhale, reach, lengthen. Exhale to chair. Inhale, reach. Exhale, swan dive forward fold. One last round. We are ready for our warrior poses. Let's go ahead and take a step to the top of our mats. Standing nice and tall, let's start with our hands in prayer. We're gonna take a big step with that right foot. Hips are square. With each inhale and exhale, sinking a little deeper into those hips. On your next breath, let's reach both arms up. Relax the shoulders back and down. Two more breaths here. On our next inhale, transitioning into warrior two. Stretching those arms in opposite directions. Bringing our gaze past that left middle finger. Let's go ahead and bring that left palm up towards the sky. Keep the legs where they're at. Shift slightly forward through the waist and tilt into reverse warrior. That left bicep should be tracking right over the ear. Two more breaths here. Cartwheel those arms back to warrior two. A 
Let's go ahead and relax those arms down by our side for a moment to prepare for Humble Warrior. So rolling those shoulders back and down. We're gonna clasp our hands behind our back, widening through the chest, opening up through the shoulders. Take a bend back into that left knee. Take a big breath here. And then exhale, dive onto the inside of that left thigh. Once you're down, just go ahead and relax the head and the neck. Reaching those arms up towards the sky. Two more breaths here. On your next inhale, let's come back up. Transition back to warrior two. Bring the palms to heart center. And then we're gonna step that right foot to meet the left foot at the tops of our mats. Now preparing for warrior three. Again, keeping those hips square, we're gonna slide that right foot straight back. Find our focus here. We're gonna shift our weight into that left leg. Reaching that right foot back. You can keep your hands in prayer or stretch both arms out in front of you. Now slowly coming out of it. Let's take a little break in mountain pose. Before we move on to the other side, we're gonna come into a wide stance with our toes slightly internally rotated. Let's go ahead and place our hands on our hips. Take an inhale, exhale, dive forward. Once you're down, go ahead and relax your head and your neck. And then you can release your hands to the floor, right in between your feet. Align your fingertips with your toes. With each inhale and exhale, drawing your head a little closer towards the ground. Let's go ahead and place our left hand right smack center in between our feet. Our right hand comes onto our hip, looking past that right shoulder. And then let's reach those fingertips up towards the sky. Inhale, exhale, and switch. The left hand starts on the hip, bringing your gaze past that left shoulder. And now reaching the left fingertips up towards the sky. We'll hold for two more breaths here. Let's go ahead and bring that left hand to meet the right hand on the mat. And we're gonna slowly come out of this as we came in. So hands back on the hips. Use your core to lift up back to standing. And then we're gonna take a step onto the other side. Starting with the hands in prayer. 
Now taking a step back with that left foot for a warrior one, keeping those hips square. Trying to plant that left foot all the way from the toes all to the heel. Two more breaths. On our next inhale, let's open up those arms, sinking a little deeper into those hips for warrior two. Bringing your gaze past that right middle finger, keeping the shoulders relaxed. Let's go ahead and bring that right palm up towards the sky. Shift slightly forward through the waist and tilt into reverse warrior. Feeling a nice opening all throughout that right side. Three more breaths here. Let's cartwheel those arms back to warrior two. Relax the arms down by your side. Now preparing for humble warrior. So rolling the shoulders back and down, interlace your grip behind your back. Take that bend back into the right knee. Take a big breath here, and then exhale to dive forward inside of that right thigh. Relaxing your head and your neck, and reaching your arms up towards the sky. We'll hold for three more breaths. On our next breath, let's inhale back up. Transition back to warrior two. Bring the palms to heart center. And then we're gonna take a step back to where we started. Preparing for warrior three on the other side. Let's go ahead and slide the left foot back, straight back. Find your focus. Now slowly bringing your weight into that right foot. Maybe even reaching your arms out in front of you. Slowly making your way out of it, hands to heart center. Inhale to sweep both arms up, palms together, hands to heart. Have a wonderful day. Namaste.